Yeah, I can't even remember the last time I've been on a date. If you could solve one problem in the world today, what would it be? I'd say racism. Nice to meet you. Are we allowed to say our names? Yeah, I'm Barry. What's your name? I'm Rina. Nice to hear you, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not as nervous as I think I should be. I'm not expecting a husband tomorrow, but I'm just here for a good time and just doing something new. I think it I took, took some time for me to get used to it. I just felt like I was talking to the wall. Alright, so um, what do you do? Oh, I'm unemployed. Okay, okay. And what are your interests? Oh yeah, I like reading. Okay, nice. I'm a sucker for science fiction. Interesting! Yeah. I'm on the opposite end. I like English literature, so... Oh yeah, oh for you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. My favourite one, it's the one I started off my English lit journey with, was Crime and Punishment. Oh, is it the one in, like, set in Italy? I, I think it's in Russia. Oh yeah, then no, I, I have not heard of it. Okay, you, you should definitely check it yeah, out, yeah. it's really good. Oh yeah, the, the most recent book I was, I was reading, it's called uh, The Three Body Problem. They made it into a Netflix show. Oh, okay. Yeah. I think it's nice that we have uh, like plenty in common. I think that helped to break the, break the ice a bit. Uh, what are you doing now? I'm in uni. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm actually going, going in this year. Oh, nice. Uh, what kind of major do you think I'm, do you think oh. I'm gonna... Yeah, take a guess. <laughs> the only information I have is that you're a kind of a science guy, so I'll take three guesses. Okay. Um, first one is something engineering. Uh, close. CS? Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, nice, nice. All right. I think he comes across as, as like smart, intelligent, in a good way, like a little bit nerdy. Do uh, you have any plans to travel anytime soon? I might go to Europe over the summer. How about you? Any plans before uni? Yeah, I'm, I'm actually going to Malaysia next week. Oh, nice! Yeah. Where in Malaysia? Just <laughs> Johor Bahru. Oh, nice, nice. Yeah, I feel like if I met her outside, we'll, we'll probably hit it off like, like way better. I was like multitasking, trying to like, finish my painting and also talking to her at the same time. Do you have any like aches or deal breakers when it comes to relationships? Uh, I, I think one thing I'm, uh, I'm kind of particular about is being late. Like 10 or 20 minutes, that's fine, but like half an hour without oh, warning me, yeah. No, 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 no. Yeah, right. I'm late sometimes, so I will <laughs> I'm working on it. How do you usually approach like dating? I think the most important thing I look out for is like if we, if we vibe, you know, like if we have the same interests, mm -hmm. yeah, all that stuff. Yeah, what about you? I think I like someone who is confident in who they are. They have values that they hold very strongly and has a drive to, to, to do something that's bigger than them. I think it's important to like establish these values like, uh, like early on in the relationship. Okay, what's an ideal first date like for you? I think one of my friends, she did rock climbing for her first date, which is interesting. I don't know how they spoke. Oh yeah, that's fun. Uh, yeah. Yeah, sounds fun. Yeah, yeah. but yeah, I'm, I'm pretty open to any type. I think I could have asked a little bit more about his dating requirements or if any or lack thereof and kind of knowing if on an on a deeper level if we are a good match if you could solve one problem in the world today what would it be and why oh that's a tough one <laughs> yeah, let me think yeah i'd say racism mm. but i've i've had friends who they've been discriminated against here and there mm. yeah so i think i think that sucks it really does. Yeah. You're deprived of opportunities that have are like completely out of your control and it's just it's just very unfair, yeah. I think coming from a majority race it is is good. It shows that he is aware of the dynamics that different cultural um, groups face, especially in this country. I was happy to hear that because it's not something that I would have expected. Okay, I have a question for you. Yes, go like, ahead. What do you think is important for, for a healthy relationship? For me, I think it's very important that there are certain values that are common, which will allow you to live life peacefully. Things that you can't change, 
things you won't negotiate on. They need to be kind of similar. How about you? I think for a long-term relationship, it's important to have the like similar goals that you want to go for. Mm -hmm. yeah, and also being willing to like talk things out instead of like jumping to assumptions. Yeah. yeah. It can get very, very painful if, if you have to deal with that all the time. All right, so I hope your painting looks... Oh. <laughs> I'm excited to see. Don't have high expectations from me as well. Yes. I try my best. <laughs> Okay, I think for the most part, the questions were pretty surface level. I would try to ask deeper questions. I think we'd have to go on a few dates to, to kind of navigate um, our dynamic. But yeah, for sure. I think we're on a level good match. Hello. Hi, nice, yeah, to, nice meet to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> so I didn't, didn't really have an image in mind. Same. Yeah. Same. Came into it no. fully blind. I think on some level, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we have. I think we have plenty in common. Yeah. Yeah, I, I would. Yeah, sure. Rock climbing. Rock climbing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for sure. Rock climbing is fun. Whoa. That's yeah. really nice. Yeah, I like the background. Wow, thanks. That's actually really good. I like the bird. Oh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah there's this. a fish Tr trying to jump over. I was very impressed by the bag. I was very impressed. I think he did a he did a much better job than me. But uh, just kind of meeting in person and interacting and and kind of after everything, seeing and saying hi, it was just kind of different and nice. It's like a, opening a present. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. All the best for uni. It's gonna be a, a journey for sure. Yeah. I say in okay in this day and age, race isn't really. I feel like race shouldn't play a big part in like, determining who you who you date and whatsoever. This shouldn't be something that people focus on. I think the love and the relationship that you do create with those differences is much more rewarding, much more stronger. And for sure, I, I would think it would be a lot more long-lasting. I'm pretty scared of cockroaches. Oh, yeah. okay. Small ones you're okay with or it's only... Oh, oh everything. 